Hey everybody, how you doing? I'm back again. Um, I'm taking requests on my Facebook because I've got a lot of friends that they like to watch me play, but you know, I don't necessarily pick out the songs or teach the songs they want to learn or want want to hear me play. So I'm taking requests. So um, please subscribe to my channel. It helps. Okay, helps me out a lot. All right. This is from Tiki from Shelbyville, Indiana. She said that grunge was her era. Grunge was not my era. Um, right about then was about the time I retired for the first time. Um, did not like the way the music turned. I was, you know, all into hair metal and stuff like that, so... But it, needless to say, I ended up l learning a few songs from that era. One of them that Tiki requested was something from Stone Temple Pilots. I learned the song Plush, okay? That was probably one out, out of my two most, most favorite songs from that era. Okay, so I'm going to teach you how to play Plush, okay? It's really not bad. It's all chords. Um, there's nothing really hard to play about it except for the chords, okay? So it's going to start up. Well, I'm going to play, play the intro, and then I'll explain what I did playing the intro. Okay, here we go. <laughs> So the very first chord is G. Okay, I like to play, what you know is I'm using four fingers when I make a G. I, in, instead of the B string being open, I like to pick up the D on the third fret on the second string. So that gives it that full sound. That. Now this song, or this chord here is a G diminished. The way that I'm playing that is my first finger is on the second fret second string my second finger is on the third fret third string my first finger is on the first or third finger is on the first string third fret so you go there you, you really try need to try just to hit the first second and third string so full chord G now take this part slide it down and add your pinky to which you, you just slid down one fret adding your pinky to the first string and the third fret Picking up the the fifth and the fourth string on that chord. Now this here's a chromatic. I'm playing the first or the second, third, and fourth string. Okay. The first one's a hammer on on the first fret, second string. Second fret, second string. to the G. Okay, so everything that I've showed you slowly. Let that one run 
Okay, that's your intro. Now the verses, you're playing five chords on the verses. One's G, one's an inverted D. Okay, what I mean by inverted is you're taking the F sharp down here on the first string and moving it up here to the sixth string. Okay, not playing the first string at all. That's real popular in like uh, Highway to Hell. Um, Eddie Van Halen used it a lot. It's in, um, oh gosh, forget the name of the song. Though. Best of both worlds, thank you. Okay, so that's a pretty common chord. Then you've got an F. You can either play the F like this, or you can play it as a bar. Okay. Next one is a C, but you're inverting the E. So you're actually barring the fifth fret on the four, fourth, third, and second string, and you're adding your third finger to the fifth string in the seventh fret. This is what it sounds like. So it's like C here, except for hear that different sound, but it's still the same chord. And then you come here. This is an E flat. I think it's uh, augmented. So what you're doing is you're barring the entire third fret from the fifth string down. You're putting your third finger on the fourth string in the fifth fret. Then you're putting your pinky finger on the fifth string in the sixth fret. Okay, so what you got here is. Remember, we got G, the um, the D with, with the F sharp as a bass note. F, you can play F either as a bar chord or you can play it however you want to play it, okay? And then the C and then the E flat augmented. Which that's one of the main chords of the chords, okay? So just here it is slow. Okay, now the bridge section. You go to D. Then I go to the C major. Add nine. Take off your third finger. Drop down to the second fret on the B. So it's that is just second, third, open on the fifth string. that E flat d diminished thing or augmented. So I've showed you all the parts, except for there's one other part of Ghost. It, it reminds me a lot of uh, that one um, Chicago song, uh, 90234 or something like that. I, I can't remember. But anyway, it's like... Okay, 
Okay, so that's G, playing it as a power chord, down to F. Now here you're actually playing a C, but you're inverting the E. And all you're playing is the two notes. So you're, you're fretting the fifth string on the third fret, and the sixth string is open. Now this here, you're going from a D up to an E flat, back down to the D. You're sliding the D. Okay, so now you just take all, all these parts that I've just showed you, you take them and you put them all together and boom, you have plush. Okay, like I said, it's not that hard. Like this one chord here is kind of hard to get and to make sound right. Um, also, I would suggest running chorus on your guitar because that's what's giving it that full sound. questions give me a holler okay feel free to um i i love questions you guys want to want to learn how to play a song send me a request i will play the song for you just you know click like and subscribe okay all right guys have a great day and i'll be seeing you again real soon all right bye